Welcome to the AACS Daily News. The Attleboro Rotary Club is currently holding their 64th annual auction. The ongoing mission of the Rotary Club is to serve others, and the funds they raise go to support nonprofits, area food pantries, soup kitchens, scholarships, and more. The online auction began on April 28th and will conclude on May 9th at 9 p.m. We spoke with Rotary President Ryan Sherman to learn more. Hi, I'm Ryan Sherman. I'm the current president of the Attleboro Rotary Club. The club does a lot here within the community. We raise funds and donate to a number of different charities, uh, certain things with the city. Uh, typically, you're going to see something along the lines of soup kitchens, different projects such as Habitat for Humanity. We did a recent build with them where we donated funds and then we provided actual community service. Same thing with the soup kitchen where we will donate funds during the course of the year and we will actually sponsor and serve some of the um, soup over at the Centenary Church. Throughout the year, we have a number of different fundraisers that we do. The auction, which is what we're currently dealing with right now, that, that's one of our biggest draws, as well as our Rotary Golf Tournament with the Attleboro YMCA. And, you know, over the years, we've had a number of different things that we've put together to raise funds that go directly back into this community. The club itself does not take any funds. There, is no, there are no paid individuals other than the minor expenses that are needed to pay for uh, bank service charges and credit card charges to run the auction and things like that. The auction is changed over over time. Where it used to be a telephone thing that would go over the radio, people would call in, they would bid, and there was a, a telephone bank. Um, then it turned into basically over time, we have the online access with being able to bid through the website, which has been phenomenal for the club. And it's allowed us to raise more funds that go again directly back into the community. And with this past year, um, thanks to Jim Jones, we actually updated the website significantly and hopefully we provide a better exp user experience for our bidders. And um, hopefully that goes a long way. This year's auction, we have a number of different items that touch different areas. We have Patriots tickets. Um, we have a, um, a flight that goes all the way to the Statue of Liberty. Um, we have some uh, jewelry from Attleboro Jewelers that there's a lot of different things that are in there, a lot of food, you know, vendors, gift certificates, things like that. There are some unique experiences as well. Uh, I believe they're from the Triborough Youth Theater, there's a season package in there. Um, from NAPS, there's a gift card with some other items that come in. There's just a lot of different things that, you know, you typically wouldn't see in a regular auction that might be unique and beneficial to you. The auction ends on Tuesday night in a staggered sections. So we have some ending at 7.30, 8 o'clock, 8.30, and 9 p.m. There's a number of different sections that actually have, um, that are an hour long during that time where they will close, as well as our all-night specials. The website to go to is www.attlebororotaryauction.com. On the Rotary Auction website, there is a link towards the top where you can create an account where basically you put in your information. So if you, know, you bid on something, we can reach out to you. Attleboro Rotary is always looking for and ex willing to accept new members. There's no uh, restriction such as you have to work within the community, you can live here as well. Um, so typically we meet Wednesdays for lunch. Depending upon how things come these days, service becomes more important than just attending a meeting. So if you're looking to be able to find ways to give back to the community in different ways, we have community service where we actually do some actual activities and run certain fundraisers and things like that to give back. There will be a televised finale to the auction featuring Attleboro Rotarians on May 9th from 7 to 9 p.m. here on AACS 15.